There is like glitter every freaking where. I'm gonna get into so much trouble. So today I'm going to be showing you guys how I got this nice little sun-kissed brown hair color in the matter of two minutes. All I used was a can of color hairspray. If you're interested, go ahead and stay tuned. Okay, so this is my hair. This is all of my hair. My natural hair, it's grown a lot, surprisingly. So I just washed it and curled it and I also cut some bangs in my hair so yeah so the spray that we're gonna be using today is from salon graphic let me see if i can show you guys that and i got this in the color honey blonde in the um number 53 so all you have to do with this is just spray your hair down with this after it's already styled or Whatever you're gonna do for the day, you don't really wanna do this before styling because it will just fade away and be a mess. Trust me, I've done it before. So um, yeah, let's get started. Before we get started, you wanna make sure you're wearing either a shirt you don't really care about or um, a towel over your shoulders or something like that so you don't get this all over the place. You probably wanna do this in a room that is well aired out even though I'm in a room with the windows closed and no fan on <laughs> i'm going for like an ombre look today so i'm just gonna mainly spray this towards the ends of my hair i'm scared okay kind of see what this is about to be looking like and it actually really smells good so that's the good thing it's not gonna make your hair smell like a whole bunch of chemicals now I have like little glitter flying around everywhere I wonder if you guys could see that well anyways let me go ahead and finish also gonna spray my bang so I can get that little sun-kissed effect Excuse my ugly faces. <laughs> now, I'm gonna turn myself around because I don't really know what the back is looking like, but we can figure that out together. I'm hunty, all right, hunty blonde. Oh my god! And a matter of two minutes. And this is super cute. Let me stop touching it because you're gonna want this to dry before you start running your fingers through it, and before you just start styling your hair, you're gonna want it to dry. And as you can see, it did get on my hands a little bit but not a lot but so far so good and it didn't make my hair feel crunchy which is a big problem with these products is it makes your hair feel really crunchy but this one surprisingly didn't and if it does all you have to do is just run your fingers through it and kind of play with your hair again so i'm gonna go ahead and let my hair dry for about five minutes or so and then i'll come right back to you guys okay guys so here is my finished look 
and I really like it. It kind of sprayed a little bit too much right here, but we're gonna fix that later on. But um, yeah, this just looks super cute. It's super like summer timey, even though summer is about to be over or already is over. This is just an alteration on if you cannot dye your hair for whatever reason, whether you have a relaxer or a perm, you just don't want to dye your hair and you're just looking for a temporary change, this is probably the product for you. I did let it dry for about 10 to 15 minutes before I started running my fingers back through it. And like I said before, you want to make sure that your hair is already styled before you begin to use this product because once it's in there, you don't want to put any more heat or any more products in your hair just because it's going to make it really um, dry. <laughs> so that's probably not the best option. But yeah, I'm in love with this new style. I will have all the information on this hairspray in the description bar below just in case you guys are interested. If you want to do a color like me, you can and you can look cute and nice and saucy. Thank you guys for watching this video. Hope you guys enjoyed. Go ahead and like, comment, and subscribe and I'll see you guys next time.